What's good, y'all? Today I'm going to show you how to play Leather by Cody Johnson. If you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button for me and stuff. I appreciate it. It's going to be in finger style, so your thumb is going to get the 6th, 5th, and 4th string. First finger 3, middle 2, and ring 1. Chord you're going to need is a D, a B minor, 0, 2, 4, 4, 3, 2, 5th string down, a G, an A, and an E minor. Um, did I, it's capo on the third fret if I didn't say that. But, um, so there's a few guitars going on, but I'm going to show you this little intro part too just because. This part right here. I'm trying, I don't want to make this a long video, but it's probably going to be. Alright, so that part. So what you're going to do, you're going to start on the fourth string and you're going to slide from two to four with your ring finger. Alright, then go with your first finger, third string, second fret. Back to the fourth fret, fourth string. Alright, like. Alright, after you do that, you're going to do a pull off from three, I mean, sorry, four to two on that third string. And land on the fourth string, fourth fret. Alright, like. Alright, so, so far. Alright, then after you do that, you're going to do this two times. Alright, and what that is, is the third string, fourth fret. Hit it two times. And then hit two and three on the second fret. Alright, like. Alright, then you're going to land on the fourth string, fourth fret. And then you're going to hit that fourth string again two more times on that fourth fret. Second fret, third string. And then third fret, second string. Alright, you're going to do that one more time. My bad. Alright, then after you do that two times, you're going to go. Alright, so that's the open third string. And then a pull off from four to two to open on the fourth string. Alright, and that's how you do that part. You're going to do it at the end of the choruses before the next verse and at the end for the outro. Alright, so all together. My bad. Hold on, I found the right string. That's all it is. Now, if you don't want to do that, you can just do this right here. Go. Let me start over. Alright, so if you want if you don't want to do that intro part, just go go D, four, three, two, three, two times. Alright, and then B minor, 5, 3, 2, 3, back to D, back to B minor, back to D, two times before the verse starts. Alright, so all together. intro if you don't want to do that other thing all right now um so let me play the verse all the way through for you and then i'll show you the pattern it's real easy it's just kind of confusing all right here we go it's going it starts on a d this is your first verse d b minor d b minor d B minor, A, D, B minor, D, B minor, D, B minor, A, D. Alright, now that was your first verse. Um, the second one is similar, but he throws a G in there. But um, 
so for the verse, you already know the D. Um, you already know the B minor. Um, so let me tell you the other pattern. So on the A, the first time you get to it, you're going to go. My bad. Don't worry, I'm gonna do it all together, but I'm just showing you the pattern. So on the A, the first time you go to it in the verse, five, three, two, three, two, one, three, two, three. All right, like. All right, so let me lead up to that. So this is the top of the verse. D, B minor, D, B minor, D, B minor. All right, now right here is that A that I was talking about. All right, that was the first half of the verse. All right, then you're going to go back to D. B minor, D. B minor, D. All right, now right here, right before the chorus, you're going to go B minor, A, D real quick, like, my bad. So all that is is on that B minor, five, three, two, A, same thing, five, three, two, and then D, just like before, four, three, two, three, four, three, two, three. All right, and that's your first verse. So all the way through for you. your first verse. Your chorus starts on a G. I'm gonna give you two different um, strum, I mean patterns. Um, I'm gonna show you the way I do it first and then I'll show you an easy way. So let me do the chorus for you. I'm trying not to make this a long video. <clears throat> Alright, so here's your chorus right here. G, D, B minor, A, G, G, B minor, A, G, E minor, A. Alright, so that's your chorus. If you want to do that pattern I was just doing, on the G it's going to be 6, 3, 4, 2, 6, 3, 4, 3. Um, you're, uh, on the D, you're going to be moving your fingers to where your first finger is on the second string, middle finger, first string, and your thumb is going to get the fourth and third string like this. Um, four, two, three, one, four, two, three, two. All right, like. All right, and then you're going to go to B minor, move your fingers back to normal. Um, five, three, four, two, five, three, four, three. A is the same thing. All right, and you already know the G. The E minor is just like the G. Six, three, four, two, six, three, four, three. And um, that's all you need to know for that part. So um, that's one pattern you can do. If it's too much for you, you can do this pattern right here. So let me play it with it and then I'll show you this pattern. All right, so here's another pattern you can do until you can do that other pattern. All right, here we go. It starts on the G. D. B minor. A. G. G. B minor, A, D, G. E minor, A. All right, so you can do that pattern if you want. It's real easy. On the G, just go six, three, two, three, four. All right, like. All right, the B minor. I mean, sorry, the D. Four, three, two, three, four. The B minor. 
five, three, two, three, four, A, same thing. Um, e minor is just like the G. Six, three, two, three, four. And that's that pattern, but it's the same progression. And the end where you do the B minor real quick, like, right, huh? Just go five, three, two, and same on the A. Five, three, two, and then G. You know what I'm saying? Um, Cause it's real quick at the end of the chorus. All right, but anyway, that's your chorus. I keep going on about it, but that's your chorus. Um, so at the end of the chorus, you're gonna do this again if you want. All right, so you can do that before the next verse starts, or you can do that other thing I showed you in the beginning. But your next verse um, kind of um, is a little different because there's a G in there. And then after this verse, he does the yippee ki yay thing. Um, so let me play along with this verse, and then I'll... You already know the pattern, so I'm just going to call it out. All right, so here's your second verse right here. D... B minor, D, B, D, B, A, D, G, D, B minor, A, hold on, I just messed up. So you already know the first half of the second verse. The second verse starts off like the first verse. D, B, D, B, D, B, A. All right, the second verse, I mean the second half of this verse. D, G, D. B minor, D, B, A, D. Alright, so that's, um, so just in case it confused you, I'm going to do this part over. So you already know the first half of the second verse, so this is the second half. D, G, D, B minor, D. B minor, A, B. Alright. And then the next part's the yippee ki part. And let me follow along with it so I'm right. I actually know there's going to be another chorus. Let me make sure it's the same. So this is the part where he says yippee ki and all that. It's, at, it's after the second chorus. All right, so I'm just going to follow along with it and just call out the chords for you. I wish I could play with it, but I don't want to get copyrighted. All right, so here's this part right here. yippee ki part. It's after the second chorus. G, D. A, B minor, G, D, A, alright, and then you're going to go into another um, chorus right here, it's the last one, 
I'm gonna play with it. <clears throat> I wish I could play along with, so y'all could hear it, but I just don't want to get copyrighted and have to redo my whole video because that's aggravating. G, D, B minor, A, G. B minor, A, G. E minor, A. All right, yeah. So at the end of the um, last chorus, after you go to that E minor and A, like the ending of the other choruses, you're gonna go straight to B minor and go. So you're gonna do that two times, the B minor, A, G, E minor, a, you're going to do that one more time. Alright, and that's going to be the end of the song. Alright, man, I'm losing circulation in my thumb, it feels like. But, um, so, another thing I wanted to mention, this last chorus, you can hear that he's keeping that first string open on that D chord. Alright, so it's going to sound like... But that isn't was leather. I hope y'all liked it. If I confused y'all or lost y'all or something, let me know. Till next time, gone.